Just imagine And now you want it Stay with me Hello everybody uh, It's me again Queenie Welcome to my channel Welcome to my vlog So ngayon uh, Papunta kami sa Tagaytay Kasi uh, Tomorrow na yung Big day For my brother so, ayan, kasama ko yung family. Ah, oh, gusto gusto talaga Siyempre. ni mama nakikita sa vlog. This is the day! <laughs> so, pala kung naalala nyo, ang first vlog ko, first ever vlog ko talaga, is yung proposal ni Kuya. So, ito yun. So, ayan. Tapos, uh, ngayon, vlog ko naman yung wedding day nila. So, tomorrow yun sa Lake Hotel, Tagaytay. So, ngayon, biyahe kami. Uh, December 9, Monday. Tapos, tomorrow yung kasal. Ayan. So, update ko kayo sa mga mangyayari. Tapos, tingnan mo yung ano, yung sasakyan na sa harap. Yung plate number NJ. Wait lang. Wait lang. Ay, ano mo? Ay, ano? ano? Oh, NJ. NJ pangalan ng kuya ko. So, talagang napatunayan natin na ngayon bukas yung big day nila. <laughs> <laughs> Dahil sa sasakyan. So, ayun, may dublog na. Bakit ano? Hi guys! So ngayon, nandito na kami sa... Uh, ano ba tawag dito? Rented house. Sa Airbnb. Charlotte siya. Charlotte. Ano ba yung Charlotte? Hindi <laughs> ko alam yun eh. So, ayun. Actually, sabi nung caretaker, yung place is good for 18 people. Pero kami, 10 lang ata kami. So, ayan. Itutur ko kayo. Wow! Higang higang si Uyama. Ayan, pwede umiga dyan. Ayan, ito, ano, feeding area. Ito, coffee, coffee area. Bar. Hindi ko alam. Ito, bar table. Tapos ito, dining. Ito ang, ano ito? GR Okay GR Okay 
Obawatinya harus dihitung Parang massage So that's it Murah nak itu ano, six fifty per head. The following day. Good morning. So nayaon, ah kakak tapas ko lang maligo. It's already quarter to eight a.m. and um pupunta ko sa hotel para sa hair and makeup for the bridesmaids and ayon. Tapos, ah, meron ko kayo shoot days, so ulit napakita ko sa inyo yung, ano, bride. So, ano na ginagawa yan? Ano na, may makeup na yun, syempre. Baka nakapagtapos na yun eh. So, ayun, pumunta na kami sa hotel na yun. Ang tatay ay sarap. Ang Kaya kaway ka naman sa vlog Pakit lang po Pakit lang po yung ano Oh, 
cannot believe that I'm the one who gets to marry you. I promise to be your faithful husband. I promise to love you when the sun shines, when the rain falls, through good times and bad. I love and cherish you, secure in the knowledge that you are my best friend, my dearest, my kind and adoring wife. It's my constant choice. It is my greatest obedience and submission to the will of God. In my life, my joy is full, no sorrow in it. My spirit rejoices, for I really feel and know that you are God's perfect will and God's promise to me. Thank you for praying for me to be your wife, for waiting, for trusting what the Lord has shown to you as a vision. Thank you for choosing me and for fighting for what is the perfect will of God for us. I will love you, support you, and tease you every day. I will always be your best friend and number one video of my contender. I will be faithful to you and to our God. I will submit to you and choose to love you no matter what. For this cause, we will live. We will do our ministry to serve the Lord all the days of our lives. I will honor you, protect your interest and your heart. I will always cheer for you, even the, even when the world doubts me. Makaasa ka na I will be your advisor. At saka, taga correct my grammar mo. <laughs> Thank you for giving me the best day of my life. There is no man else for me but you. I love you with the love of the Lord. This I swear in, um, in the name of Jesus and all among the love and prayer. I love you. So, to make your love grow, you must continue to think of one another, to date one another, and to take time to know each other more. As I read earlier, the Bible says, Husbands, live here with your wife in an understanding way. That means pretend you understand her, even though you never will. Right? When you don't understand her, just say, I love you. Okay? And everything will be solved. It will take trust to know in your hearts that you truly know what's best for each other. It will take dedication to stay open to one another and to learn and grow together. And it will take loyalty to go forward together without knowing exactly what the future brings. And it will take commitment to hold true to the journey you are both pledged today. So now let me pronounce the blessing on you as newlyweds. Okay. Father, we ask that you would bless this marriage of NJ and Zeller as they start their journey together. We don't know what the future holds, but thank God we know who holds their future. And he is the greater one. And your plan for them is beautiful. And you are committed to helping them fulfill that beautiful plan. In this marriage, may your name be glorified. Zeller and NJ, may the Lord bless you. May the Lord protect you. May the Lord smile on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord show you his favor and grant you his peace. Here we go. And now, and now, get your cameras ready. By the power vested in me as your pastor, and before Almighty God, it's my honor and delight to publicly declare the two of you legally married. Go forth and multiply. NJ, you may now kiss your new wife.
with family and friends, I am so pleased to present to you the new Mrs. NJ and Stella Calera. Love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast. It is not proud, it is not rude. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, and always perseveres. Ah, ah. 